Hello Internet, I am the final boss and this is a game called Behind. It's a demo and it's made by the guy who made uh, Buried Beneath, a game I recently played and reviewed and said was really bad and it turns out that I skipped half the game. So we're gonna go ahead and try out another one of this kid's games and see what happens. Okay, I want to get this thing straight. We need his remains. I can't tell you why just yet, but I can tell you, but what I can tell you is that it's not going to be a walk in the park. Go to the basement, pick up the bones and leave. Shouldn't be too hard, right? Yeah. What's the, what's, what's the hard part? Why am I picking up someone's remain? Whoa. Definitely not going to be too dark with this one. I'm already liking the feel. Okay. So far I'm interested. Don't you thunder at me. Yes. Let's go upstairs where the basement is totally going to be. Yeah, great idea. Def definitely part of the job that I am supposed to do. Ah, pictures of lamps. Perfect. Four chemicals are needed to create an acid. So now I gotta go find chemicals. Oh, and there's actually a nice little thingy. That's helpful. Definitely gonna tell me how to go get those Where would chemicals be? If I were a chemical, where would I be? Is this supposed to be spider webs? Sticky residue? So I need the acid to burn off the sticky residue. The, st the sticky residue? Eh? Eh? Hmm. Are you a chemical? Are you a chemical? You are... N you are a chemical! Ooh, okay, so the chemical... Oh no, the chemicals aren't selectable. Ah, uh, that's gonna be... That's gonna be a ton of fun. Uh, if I were some more chemicals, where would I be? Uh, ah, here we go. Chemical number two. Maybe there are some chemicals in here. I mean, I feel like that's something a game would do, put chemicals where they're supposed to be. I feel like that's someone, that's something that someone that had a house would do. Ah. That's exactly where I'd put my chemicals. I sleep with them every night. It actually helps me to sleep, to be honest. I, I can only think either there's a key in here to get to that one room. Or, there's a room I haven't been to because I'm dumb. Ah, well, I'm out. I seem to have done a pretty good job getting away. Ah, yeah, see, key. That was just as, just as expected. Could that thing have killed me? Probably not. I feel like that was a scripted scene. We just finished checking the building today before it was demolished. But unfortunately, the family that wanted the land could not retrieve it. The reason for this was because of the basement. Just one inhale of those toxic gases can make you hallucinate, maybe faint. We first found this out when we, when me and our team came over, but as we explored the place, one of our workmen ventured into the basement. But we didn't know where he was. We just heard large banging sounds and someone screaming and following it isn't her fault, it isn't bang, it isn't yours, bang, bang, bang. Then there was silence, and suddenly an anticlimactic light started to swing above the main hall. It hasn't stopped since. We went down to rescue him, but we found him dead with green frothy fluid oozing from his eyes, nose, and mouth. This is caused from a toxic gas called arsenic, ar arsenic, arsenic, <clears throat> arsenic pentafluoride. Try saying that five times, I couldn't say it once. We thought it was best to leave the house as it is, lock the basement, and put up a toxic sign just to be safe. The family were distraught when. <sighs> Families tend to be distraught when. Why is your dining hall in your attic? No? No? No one's gonna... No? no okay. I'm gonna question it. Oh. Am I not supposed to stare at them? What exactly am I supposed to be doing? Oh, 
Oh, uh, how's it going, girls? Hey, what's up? How's it? Oh. Apparently, I'm not supposed to walk into them. Although, I technically walked through those ones. Alright, I'll be back. I'm back. He didn't leave, you leave. Uh, that's different. So I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. Obviously I can't go that way. I have to go down, right? Oh, what's that? Oh, crap! Still coming at me? What am I doing? These Bunsen burners aren't Bunsen burning. Oh, this is the... I'm dumb. This is probably the actual... The actual stuff. Let's take it over here. There we go. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, not this again. Is it a maze? Wait, is it... Oh, you did not. Okay, if it's a maze, then that means there's a right and wrong way to go. And I'm going to go off on a limb and say it's this way. Oh, well, you're creepy. How's it going? I'm going to go ahead and leave you to do whatever it is you want to do uh, far away from me. Ha! Huh. Did I just trap myself? But there was no explanation as to where to go! What? What? What was I supposed to do? Okay, I don't know. I'm gonna give it one more shot. So, yeah. Oh no, never mind. Okay, the game might have glitched last time. And she may have just not followed me like she was supposed to. I just gotta make sure not to go down to dead end. I just don't know where I'm supposed to be going exactly then. This is a room. Ah! There we go. Ah! Not you! So I gotta get- I gotta get out of here. I am not gonna let that guy get me. Wait! Yeah, this is the right way. Perfect. Okay, yeah, you just keep... Don't get stuck on that! Alright, we're almost there. We're almost out. Ooh! Get out of here. One final jump scare? No? Hey, that actually worked! Okay. It was a pretty good game. I like this game. Two suggestions. Number one, and I can't reiterate this enough. Checkpoints. I hated having to restart the game from the beginning. It took like enough time to just be kind of a pain I really enjoyed this one uh, thanks for developing this one I, I really enjoyed it I may play another one of your games we'll see about that now once again as to the actual audience thank you guys so much for watching subscribe for more horror games like this video if you liked it and I will see you in the next video